Our other top story tonight, the Macomb County Sheriff says detectives are looking for multiple persons of interest in a deadly shooting at a 4th of July block party in Mount Clemens. Shooting at the corner of Court Street and Clemens, it took the life of 24-year-old Charlie McGowan. It left another victim badly injured. Sean lay live where it happened and investigators are there, I guess, right now, Sean, still. A lot of investigators coming right back to this scene. You can see them behind me here checking for more shell casings with a metal detector. Pan to your right, K9 also out here helping look for clues. And we have investigators going door to door looking for any type of witnesses. Big crowd out here after midnight around 1220 this morning. And at least three people pull out guns and start firing into that crowd. Macomb Sheriff's investigators combing over every inch of this section of Court Street in Mount Clemens. A 4th of July block party here went past midnight. Fireworks were going off and then calls to 911 were coming in. When deputies arrived, they found 17 shell casings from three different guns. They found blood but did not find any victims. And they received a call from McLaren Hospital indicating that two individuals uh, arrived at the hospital separately. Uh, both suffering from gunshot wounds. Gun battle in the middle of a block party. 24-year-old Charlie McGowan, known as CJ from Clinton Township, was shot and killed. A 26-year-old woman also from Clinton Township sitting in a car nearby was shot in her leg. Investigators working all night discovering McGowan was a target of people he had problems with. We believe there's a relationship, uh, possibly a feud uh, between our victim and our persons of interest. A block away, a cleanup from a block party here. And sadness that a celebration turned deadly. And we're having a great time out here, and then un unfortunately, that had to happen. I mean, it's just senseless, man. Over on Court Street, up to 70 people were here when people started firing. Everybody know that guns kill, but it's the people that's, that, that, that's using them that's killing. Back here live, not far from downtown Mount Clemens, these investigators combing through this yard here. We can see them up and down this block. A lot of activity here because the gunmen have not yet been caught. Look at this. Up and down the street here, you see marks like this. This is where shots were hitting trees. So investigators are saying they're really surprised more people weren't actually hit. The 26-year-old woman from Clinton Township, she was hitting her leg, had surgery at noon today, and the sheriff expects her to be okay. That's the very latest, Devin. Sean, so many people at this block party, that would suggest plenty of witnesses, right? Yeah, up to 70 people, plenty of witnesses, but the sheriff is saying that very few people at all are cooperating with their investigation. They're hoping they'll get some anonymous information through Crime Stoppers or calling the sheriff's office because they're still trying to track down a couple of people of interest uh, involved in this. The gunmen have not yet been caught. What a problem we see so often. All right, Sean.